Dell introduced CAM in 2022 with modules that were 57% thinner than so dim. Move over, so dim. A new type of memory module has been made official, and backers like Dell are hoping that it eventually replaces so dim, small outline dual inline memory module, entirely. This month, JEDEC, a semiconductor engineering trade organization, announced that it had published the JESD 318 compression attached memory module, CAM2, standard, as spotted by Tom's hardware. CAM2 was originally introduced as CAM via Dell, which has been pushing for standardization since it announced the technology at CES 2022. Dell released the only laptops with CAM in 2022, the Dell Precision 7670 and 7770 workstations. The standard includes DDR5 and LPDDR5 fifths X designs. The former targets, performance notebooks and mainstream desktops, and the latter is for, a broader range of notebooks and certain server market. Segment. JEDX announcement said. They each have the same connector but differing pinouts, so a DDR5CAMM2 can't be wrongfully mounted onto an LPDDR5 fifths X connector. CAM2 means that it will be possible to have non-soldered LPDD5X memory. Currently, you can only get LPDDR5X as soldered chips. Time equals 400 ms, greater than another reason supporters are pushing CAM2 as in consideration of speed, as so dim tops out at 6400 MHz, with max supported speeds even lower in four dim designs. Many mainstream designs aren't yet at this threshold. But Dell originally proposed CAM as a way to get ahead of this limitation, largely through closer contact between the module and motherboard. The published CAMM2 standard says LPDDR5 DRAM CAMM2 is expected to start at 6400 MTs and increment upward in cadence with the DRAM speed capabilities. Samsung in September announced plans to offer LPDDR CAM at 7.5 gigabits per second, noting that it expects commercialization in 2024. Micron also plans to offer CAM at up to 9,600 megabits per second and 192 gigabytes plus per module in late 2026, as per a company roadmap shared by Anantech last month. Both announcements were made before the CAM2 standard was published, and we wouldn't be surprised to see timelines extended. CAM2 supports capacities of 8 gigabytes to 128 gigabytes on a single module. This opens the potential for thinner computer designs that don't sacrifice memory or require RAM modules on both sides of the motherboard. Dell's precision laptops with Dell's original CAM design is 57% thinner than so dim, Dell said. The laptops released with up to 128GB of DDR5-3600 across one module and thinness as low as 0.98 inches, with a 16-inch display. Nominal module dimensions listed in the standard point two. Various form factors for the modules, with the x-axis measuring 78 mm, 3.07 inches, and the y-axis 29.6 to 68 mm, 1.17 to 2.68 inches. Computers can also achieve dual-channel memory for more bandwidth with one cam compared to so dim's single-channel design. Extra space could lead to better room for things like device heat management. Time equals 400 ms, greater than JEDEX announcement said. By splitting the dual-channel CAM2 connector lengthwise into two single-channel CAM2 connectors, each connector half can elevate the CAM2 to a different level. The first connector half supports one DDR5 memory channel at 2.85 mm height while the second half supports a different DDR5 memory channel at 7.5 mm height. Or, the entire CAM2 connector can be used with a dual-channel CAMM2. This scalability from single-channel and dual-channel configurations to future multi-channel setups promises a significant boost in memory capacity. Unlike their taller so dim counterparts, CAMM2 modules press against an interposer which has pins on both sides to communicate with the motherboard. However, 
It's also worth noting that compared to so dim modules, CAMM2 modules are screwed in. Upgrades may also be considered more complex since going from 8GB to 16GB, for example, would require buying a whole new CAM and getting rid of the prior rather than only buying a second 8GB module. Time equals 400 ms greater than JEDEX standardization should eventually make it cheaper for these parts to be created and sourced for different computers. It could also help adoption grow, but it will take years before we can expect this CAM 2 to overtake 26-year-old so dim, as Dell hopes. But with a few big names behind the standard and interest in thinner, more powerful computers, we should see a greater push for these modules in computers in the coming years. You can download the CAM2 standard from JEDEC's website.